Welcome back everyone. This is one way of testing out washing machines. Three in one go. Got this one going. It's going to go for four hours. This one's got uh, 48 minutes remaining. I won't be here when it finishes. And this one here has got an hour and 21 minutes. As you can see it's flashing across. It doesn't do that when it's a normal screen. Uh, just quickly show you there. If you, I don't know whether you might be able to see that. 48 minutes. And this one's got like I was saying, 4 hours and 5 minutes I don't know why the LED screens do that but anyway we will be putting through a whole heap of cans, cartons of plastic this afternoon um, this is the follow up for yesterday I've actually thought well I'm going to town I might as well take what we've got also in bags here um, but I haven't unloaded none of what we've got here so we'll be putting that through probably last i don't know i'll see how things go and to see how things work out and that sort of thing i do mind on my camera angle here uh just holding it with my hand um so yeah have your guesses on see how much it'd be i reckon that and that together that's a big bag that bag and that will take up one shopping cart there's about 30 40 dollars in that so there's about two or three hundred units in there maybe something like that so we're going to be fairly large today um it's going to be more than what i usually cart in the back of here so with all to do i'll just get to town and start putting it through the machine i suppose probably the best thing i've got to work out how i'm going to put it all in uh bags the, the glass bags i'll probably put in the back here because i'm not tying them up uh, i might just tie these other plastic ones on the back once I shut the lid down. So anyway, got some water going on around the place over here. And uh, yeah, let's get to town. Before we go do the cans, we got a couple of things to pick up. Had to bring the trailer. Doesn't matter. We've got all the equipment we need. Little rope to hook onto them. Don't know how many we got. I think we only got two, two dishwashers. We'll take them. These are quite simple. Oh, I've finessed these pretty well. Well, they've chopped the cord off this one. It doesn't bother me. Easily replaced to try and repair it. I think I've got parts for these. I think I've got parts. They've been customer returns. How I know? They got a tag on the front. Come back with a fault. Not hard to put a cord back in. forward oh, lost it when am I not losing it that didn't happen the way it was supposed to take a moment to find out what we've got That'll go there. I might do without the rope. Washing machines, you know, front load of washing machines, that sort of thing. We might have a look in the electrics over here. There might be a TV even. Spin that around. Like there's a TV there, flat screen TV, a few other bits and pieces. We'll grab that stuff as well. That 
hinder sig. Så kommer jeg til at sætte det her. Hvad er det, vi skal få? Oh yeah, take the TV, another monitor there, two monitors actually, they'd be all busted up, like usual, yeah it's got a big ass dent in the front, She's been buggered. They slashed that. Not to worry. Sit that there. Another one there. And another one there. He's buggered. He's not. He might sit that one in the front. What else we got over here? No, not touching the printer, not touching that, nothing in that. Okay, that's it for here. Didn't get that, did I? There we go. Seen a can back here, I'll grab it too. Finally got it all unloaded. Finally got it all unloaded. Anyway, push this into the shade without making any fall off. I'm gonna yeah, making any fall off. I'll fall off anyway. Um, I'm gonna start with the glass first. It's quite warm using some other gloves today have a change of gloves very shortly so I'm just going to put these in line I've still yet to oh dear untie those so I better do that first uh, turn that noisy thing off so I don't get booted off the good old YouTube had it running listening to some wireless shut that down Change the gloves, get, get the screwdriver over here, get our clean pair of gloves. Oh, don't forget the phone, don't forget the phone, you're already here, you might as well get it. Right, seem we're going to start with the glass, we'll put the phone over here. Oh, what do you want? Yeah, okay, clear. I don't want to know you. Go into the app. They're open, love. Hi. They're open. Working. Yeah, working. All right. All right. Sit that one there. I've got a label for that one. Sit the gloves there. I always recycle meat zip ties. Put a screwdriver in the tongue of it and I undo it. That one. Turned out a nice hot day. Quite a warm one, really. It's taken me roughly half an hour to unload this. Right, we'll put them in the vehicle. Don't need that tool anymore. Put them up there that there, grab our gloves I'll move them out of your road bro you can, ta you can take that one if you like yeah take that one alright phone's still working good Nice 
nice and tight. And let's get into it. Come on. On the side, bro.
Okay, let's start the hands. Did I put you out on that? Yes, I did. Yeah, they don't go through, right? They don't go through. That won't fit under there. Nope. Persevere with it that way, I suppose. Oh, thanks, Frank. You dimmers. Oh, come on. Load of baloney. Not mucking around with it. I didn't want you to pay out, you silly bugger. Technical issues.
You look lost, love. No, I've actually been here for a long time and I have not seen any reading glasses here. <laughs> I've been here since the truck came. That's including unloading it all. Come on, go through.
Don't say you're coming back. Right, get into the bag and then I'll do those two. Back up again. Do away with those. That into there. Someone's car alarm going off. Right. Yeah, come on. Work for me. Here we go. Come on. Come on. Here we are.
it wants to try to go in that one it's not going to go in though must be feeling left out <laughs> Move it. Move your high knees. I think we've got a glass one down here. Certainly do. So we'll save that one for last. Oh baloney, come on. Could do with a drink at the moment. That's why I haven't been talking much. It's dry. Dry and patched. Put that through last. That's one trolley done. Two over there. Get down to this one.
through, go through, go through, go through, go through. Thank you. Can I give you a suggestion, love? Sorry? Put your glass in there. See, I'm finished with it. Just leave it there. Leave it there and you can continue with your, your cans. Yeah. That way when you sort your glass, that's sorting your glass out too. When you're doing that. So if you've got a bag with glass, that way you can put the glass in there and you can put your cans through at the same time. So you're sorting it out at the same time. Thank you. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. It's always handy to have it sorted out before you come down. True you that. don't have to do it when you get here. It's not going to go through, I don't think. No. It won't go through. Too much chewing gum on it. And this hook here is to put your bag on. Yes, love. Oh, thank you. That gives you two hands, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> there you go. A lot of people don't know what that's for. They think it's to open the machine. No. <laughs> now the key's on the side, and that's how they open it. <laughs> Try it. Too bad for it. Last one. Nah. He's through now. Put 
this last got bottled through and we'll get going. Up there. Oh, come on, go back. Malfunctions. <laughs> right, I only need one hand anyway. Come on, find out how much we got. Put our bottle top away. Well, that is more than I thought it would be. I tell you what. I didn't think it was going to end. Finally made it home, unloaded the two uh, dishwashers and all the other stuff that we picked up at Harvey Norman. So I will be testing those. I will definitely testing those. Still testing these other washing machines in the background. Um, but anyway, <coughs> we put through 1,552 units. Uh, actually, no, sorry. 1,500. 1,572 units. So that's what we've put through. Um, so it's $157.20. Pretty bloody good. With what we've been collecting here um, and yesterday's mop that we've put through. I reckon we would have got, just with yesterday's lot, around oh good estimation about 70 80 dollars give or take somewhere around there i don't know because we've put it all through we've got none here now which is good it offloaded it back into the machine recycled it so anyway that's what we've put through 1572 units 157 dollars um, now I'm still testing these washing machines. Uh, this one's got a minute to go. I started this one here, uh, restarted it, it's got a minute to go. Spinning out at uh, 800 RPMs, drifts per minute. Uh, it's pretty quick. This one here, it's just doing a wash and, a, and it's still got 40 minutes to go. I've restarted it again. This one, if you remember, it was about four hours or something like that. So. It's been a while since I've been out and come back and it's only got half an hour to go. It's got a high spin on it. I think that's about uh, 1,200 RPMs. Faster than your car can order. So yeah, that's what I do with the wash machines. Uh, June's been helping out with stripping out wire and that sort of thing. Uh, I've got a whole bucket over there that we've been doing. So there will be a scrap run probably in the new year for all the... Um, copper wire the aluminium um, like I'll just give you a, I'll show you what we've done with our aluminium one of these bloody big ass square well I call them big square pods um, but this is all of our aluminium in one of those big pods that's all of um, not not extruded aluminium that's just ordinary aluminium like rims all of our pressed pressed up aluminium that sort of thing so yeah uh, we've got about five or six blocks in there um, around the back out here we've got our cast alloy here cast alloy here um, you might, might remember a couple of videos back um, that I picked these up behind uh, 10 pin bowling they're cast alloy a couple of um, mowers cast alloy the rims are going over with the other pod there uh, extruded alloy non painted um, and then we've got the painted extruded over here I had to separate it because there is two different prices for that and where we're going um, he does take these I've just got to get to and take the copper out of the end of the alloy there so it's only a matter of chop it off a bit closer up there um and then he'll take it as exactly alloy uh radiators so yeah and that's even with those 
so that's what we've got there oh we've got a bit of an old extruded over the back there as well so been working hard copper in the corner here got a whole heap of copper pipe motors down here um, transformers and little solenoids and stuff like that that I'm not even going to bother processing uh, got about two buckets of brass sitting there and uh, yeah still got a lot to go through but anyway um, that's about all it is on the home front oh, I'll probably have a video coming out uh, with me doing a one of me putting all of our motors through uh, processing all of our motors uh, getting all the cast alloy off that sort of thing so yeah getting all the plastic out of them I don't like sending plastic through that's just me though uh, but anyway on the home front what we've got in our copper this is our number two full wheelie bin can't press it down it's a bloody lot uh, we've started our number one it's only a small bin we may have to upgrade it <laughs> by the time we're finished uh, got an empty one there so we might have to use that uh, this one here is the insulated number two still got a fair bit to put in there and that's about all I can say um, yeah June sitting down over here on the phone just answering some questions oh you answering questions oh good oh good oh she's answering our questions oh well there you go well yes that's been and gone oh damn I've got something in my eye anyway um yeah so if you've come this far in the video we got um what was it 1550 1572 units i wrote it down <laughs> so i didn't have to look at my phone um yeah i had to do it a quick look and yeah i thought well that's the easiest way but anyway like i was trying to say if you've come this far in the video um don't forget to like subscribe and we will see you in the next one. Cheerio.